Hey, yo, what is going on guys? Horcrux here and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we will be discussing one of the most broken dueling sets you will ever come across and God forbid you come across MagDK running this setup. So let's hop into it. Welcome back ladies and gentlemen before we hop into the bread and butter of today's video a huge and glorious shout out to my patrons and also my community members without whom this would not be possible I really appreciate your guys support from the bottom of my heart it means the world to me so why am I even doing this video so a couple days ago on stream I was doing a couple million gold giveaway and I was doing my viewers whether you win or lose you're gonna go away with some gold you beat me you get 100k even if you attempt you get 10k well me being a little egotistical right i thought i could pack anyone up but that was not the case so went to the sweaty dueling arena and i can pretty much pack a 90 percent of people up but the classes i had a lot of trouble with was running drowerkin i think draw drawkarin drowkarin draw drawkarin whatever this set is absolutely nutty especially on the magicka dragonite now you can run this on pretty much any class and get away with it so what does this set even, I didn't know what this set was. My chat had to tell me what this set even did. That's how out of shape I am in dueling. But let me tell you, after farming this and slapping it on my DK, oh my lanta, you hit like a freaking Mack truck, fellas. So what is this set? Now, I'm not gonna go over my entire build. There's two different builds you could run with this. Um, the more meta dueling build for the Magicka Dragonite in particular, is going to be a uh, Drakrin sword. However, however you say this this freaking set and burning spell weave with the Markian Ring of Majesty as well with Magna Incarnate One Piece Trainee. That is like the super meta Mag DK dueling build. Now I like running a counter meta build, so I replace burning spell weave with a force Iron Blood that helps offset a lot of this damage, which this is almost impossible to heal through it it is incredible it, it's so hard to beat a magic of dragonite running this set so the two piece gives you max and magic yeah, that's awesome three piece gives you penetration also awesome four piece gives you recovery that's awesome the five piece dealing direct damage to an enemy places a ghastly curse or a ghostly curse on your enemy for six seconds Cursed enemies take 617 extra damage from all of your damage abilities. This effect can occur every 9 seconds. So it has a reasonably high uptime. And no, it's not 617. It's actually half that because of the uh, the Battle Spirit debuff. But guys, on the Magic of Dragonite, you probably have 8 or 9 dots at any given time. And each single one of these dots are going to be hitting for 300 harder. Okay, so this is probably about 20% increase to... All of your dots across the board it hits so hard man like poisons it procs out poisons as well you toss ash cloud on it hits boss out armor you get more damage burning embers engulfing flames talons whip yada yada whatever entropy whatever you want to toss on this is going to bolster all this damage by additional 300 now this can crit so the way this set actually works and functions it adds the damage to your dot and then that dot can then crit so it really really sucks getting hit by this guys like if you're ever in the doing read i'm sure you guys if you were watching this video have more experience than i am but this set will absolutely pack you up this works really good on the magic of sorcerer as well because you can run force pulse as three instances of damage each one is one of those instances of damage is going to do more damage you guys get it right so any this this is going to hurt with a dot build you run this on a dot build man you're going to tear stuff up now like this says pretty pretty nutty you farm this unhallowed graves i believe you have to have the horror storm dlc in order to uh, farm it luckily i already had it before i went free to play so it was no problem to me now without getting too much in the build because this is going to be a build video for a later right um you could run this with an inferno staff or my personal favorite is dual wield. this a dual wield is also viable um i believe if you want to run dual wield, you need to run talons as well as power lash but if you want to run an inferno staff which is considered the meta right now on pc and a you'll want to run um ellie drain instead of talons and then you'll run molten whip instead of power lash the reason i have this set up 
is to beat the Magplar. The only way to really beat a really, really, really good Magplar with this set, you have to be able to tank their Onslaught when they pop their Balrogs, their Orlamaze, Clever Alchemist. When they go in for the burst, they're going to hit you way harder than any spin to win will ever hit you. So you have to be able to tank through that. And once you live through that, then you can kind of put off the offensive. So that's why I like running Power Lash on this. But again, this is not a build. I just want to explain to you how amazing this set is now i did duel for a couple hours um against this set and then some today um i should have some videos somewhere up on the screen here kind of showing you um what that's all about and guys when this proxy you, you just go ham just go super offensive and yeah so this is by far the best dueling set that i've come across and i'm sure you can toss this like again on stamina classes it doesn't really matter what class you want to toss this on it's going to work for you so if you want to get into dueling i highly suggest you farm this again this comes from the unhallowed layer it's very easy to farm a normal and guys please when you get armor drops bind them immediately just so you don't get duplicates of them during your run even if it's not of the drower can you know, whatever how you say the set set if it's any set just go ahead and bind it so you don't run the risk of getting it again especially with the weapons at the end just ask people be nice ask them hey give me any of your weapons i'm filling out the scrapbook and doesn't matter what level they are you know even if they're even if they're like level 30 or whatever you can still fill out your scrapbook and fill out yeah you get you fill out your scrapbook and uh, get the, the items that you want again uh, you should probably run a sword and mace or you can run the inferno staff entirely up to you but yeah we'll get into the build video tomorrow i'll show you personally what i'm running we'll dissect it uh, part by part but yeah um hopefully you like today's video i'm gonna start doing a lot more dueling on other classes as well i'm gonna grind out some stamina classes for you fellas as well so if you want to see me struggle with the stamina class well please hit that like and subscribe button so you're notified of the content when it goes out and you get to make fun of me of how absolute dog crap i am at the game if i'm not playing a magicka class so with all that being said guys thank you for watching have a great rest of your day and peace